Hey, Papa. I brought some friends for dinner. Is there enough for four? Oh, what's wrong with you, stupid? <laughs> Why do you think he kills with those? Anything that swims. <laughs> this is Giornale today. Ugh, that photo's a fake, Papa. Everyone in Porta Rosa pretends to believe in sea monsters. <gasps> <laughs> well, I'm not pretending. That was hard to watch. You, uh, coming? We do not go anywhere near the surface. Got it? Everything good is above the surface. Walking. Air! <gasps> the sky, clouds, the sun. Whoa, don't look at it. Just kidding. Definitely look at it. Lucky today. Hmm? Hey, leave them alone. Hop on. Go start a club for losers. My name is Julia Marcovaldo. We underdogs have to look out for each other. What's under the dogs? <laughs> this is my dad. Why do you think he kills with those? Anything that swims. Mine. There's a million things you think you can't do. All you need is a chance to try. Woo! <laughs> Something's fishy with you two. This is too dangerous. Ah, oh, yes. ah! I know your problem. You got a Bruno in your head. A Bruno? Say, Silencio Bruno. Silencio Bruno. Louder. Silencio Bruno! Silencio Bruno! Silencio Bruno! Silencio Bruno! Can you still hear him? Nope! Just you! Good! Now hang on! Uh, uh, Silencio Bruno! What's wrong with you, stupid You do it now. Just say the thing. What's wrong with you, stupid <gasps> have to look out for each other, right? Underdogs! This is gonna be the best summer ever. We'll ride down every road. See the whole world together. It'll be amazing. <laughs> but there's just one thing. Whoa. Uh -oh. whoa, 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 wait, D did you see that? No one can find out. Please don't take my sunshine Did you boys say you were from? <laughs> Louis El Gato. Imagine a world where summer isn't just a season, yeah! but a state of mind. In Luca, we want to take you to this wonderful, nostalgic look on Italian summers. Classic human town. Pretty cool, right? Luca is about these two sea monsters, and they experience the world outside the water. Have you ever gone to the human town? Most of the story on land is in a fictional place called Porto Rosso. It just sounds nice, doesn't it? Porto Rosso. Porto Rosso. Porto Rosso. Porto Rosso. When people dream of going on a perfect vacation, mm, that's literally what Porto Rosso is. Come on, I'll show you some more stuff. 
Pixar has a history of wanting to make our films feel authentic, and so part of that is doing research. Taking the team to Italy was such a pleasure. I promise you told me everything you see! Sorry, too much? <laughs> Never! Our Pixar research trips make us look like very odd tourists because we're looking at the kind of details that we're trying to capture. We want it to be like a postcard you can jump into and really feel immersed by. The laundry in the wind, kids having watermelon, and people having their espresso. Espresso! <laughs> I love Miyazaki's movies. The texture, the details, the way he draws has been a great inspiration for me. When I saw Enrico's short La Luna, he called our attention to things around us that are beautiful. I love that this film is an expansion of that feeling. It's so beautiful. Yes, we need it. Luca will, without a doubt, transport you to this vibrant world. <laughs> Watching it, I felt like I was there. Wow. <laughs> Makes me want to move to Italy. I think we should all live there. Sign me up for that, like, right now. Yeah! This is gonna be the best summer ever. Oh.